All right, good morning, mathematicians. Well, guess what? We got a new shape that we're going to be talking about today. Now, I wonder if you can guess what shape that is. Oh, oh, there it is. It's not a square. It's not a triangle. It's not a circle. <gasps> nice job, guys. It's a rectangle. Now, the rectangle kind of looks like the square, doesn't it? It might be a cousin. It might be a relative. But it's a little different, isn't it? When you look at the rectangle, boys and girls, and you describe it, mathematicians, how would you describe that shape that we're talking about today? Well, you could talk about the number of sides. How many sides does our shape have? Well, let's count them. One, two, three, four. It has four sides. Nice job. So does a square. But what's different about these sides? Oh, look at the sides across from each other. They're the same. But they're different than the vertical sides of the shape. So your horizontal sides are the same and your vertical sides are the same. So the sides across from each other are the same in the rectangle. So it's kind of like a square squished down. Good job. Now, just like a square and all the other shapes we've talked about, these rectangles can be different sizes. They can be tiny little rectangles. Or they can be huge rectangles. But boys and girls, when we describe our shapes, we need to remember that we use those special words. So for this two-dimensional shape, our rectangle, it has four sides. Now, how many corners does our rectangle have? Oh, that's where the sides meet. So we have one, two, three, and four corners in our rectangle. So we have four corners too. Now, just like our circle and our square and our triangle, our rectangle needs to be closed. Because what happens if it's open and one of those sides is not met? Who gets in there? Yeah, those ants get in there. So your rectangle needs to be closed. And the last thing about this shape, what type of lines does it have? Does it have swiggly lines? Does it have curved lines? Does it have straight lines? Good job. Those lines on the rectangles are always straight. They're not curved. They're not squiggly. They are straight. So, boys and girls, Today, I'd love for you guys to see if you could go on a little scavenger hunt. See if you can find five rectangles. If you can find five rectangles, see if you can find more. So do a search. Maybe you can go inside your house. Or maybe you can find a flat rectangle outside. See what you guys can find. Okay. Hope you guys have a great day, mathematicians. And I will see you tomorrow. Adios.